Hello guys, welcome to this video. In this video, our question is the perimeter of a square is 48 cm. The area of a rectangle is 4 cm square less than the area of the square. If the length of a rectangle is 4 cm greater than the breadth, then find the perimeter of the rectangle. So, this is our question as always. So, first it is given perimeter of the square is 48 cm. So, perimeter of the square is given 48 centimeter. So, from this we can find out the area on the each side of the square. So, each side of the square is equal to perimeter by 4 that will be 48 by 4. So, 12 centimeter. So, this is the each side of the square. So with this 12 cm we can find out the area of the square. So area of the square is equal to 12 into 12 and that will be equal to 144 cm square. So you got the area of the square. Now in the equation it is mentioned the area of the rectangle is 4 cm square less than the area of the square. So therefore area of the rectangle is equal to area of square minus 4. So area of square is 144 then minus 4. So 140 centimeter square. So this is the area of the rectangle. So now we write that let the breadth of the rectangle is equal to x centimeter. So, therefore, length of a rectangle is equal to x plus 4. And in as in the equation is mentioned, that the length of a rectangle is 4 centimeter greater than its breadth. So, the, if um, breadth is x centimeter, so length will be x plus 4 centimeter. So, now we know that area of a rectangle is equal to length into breadth. So, area is equal to length into breadth. So, you put down the values. So, area is 140 and length is x plus 4 multiplied by x. So, you solve this. So, x 140 is equal to x into x, x square plus x into 4, 4x. So, you rearrange the numbers like this, it will become x square plus 4x minus 140 is equal to 0. So, now it has entered the quadratic form. Now, I have to solve this. We have to solve this in such a way that we have to break this 4x in two parts such that they will become 4x if we will subtract or add them and they will become 140 if we will multiply them. So for that we need to do the prime factorization of 140. So 140 prime factorization, 2, two will go, then 70, then 2, then 35, then by 5 we take, it will become 7. So with this 4 digits, we have to make it 4x by adding or subtracting them so it will become like this 5 into 2 so 5 twos are 10 and 7 into 2 so 5 into 2 is 10 and 7 into 2 is 14 so 14 minus 10 that will become 4x 14 minus 10 that will be 4 so it like it like this for x square plus 14x minus 10x a minus 140 is equal to 0. So now clearly 140, uh, sorry, 14x minus 10x is equal to 4x and 14 into 10 that will be 140. Now I take the common. So x is taken common in uh, these two terms. So x plus 14 minus take then x plus 14 here. So x plus 14 again we take as common from this x plus 14 and this x plus 14. And remainder is x minus 10 is equal to 0. So now, either x will be equal to minus 14 
or x will be equal to 10 as uh, if we take them separately that x plus 14 is equal to 0 then if we will take 14 to the right side then it will become minus 14 and x if we take only this part separately then a minus 10 if we will take to this side it will become 10 so now we have to keep this in mind that we are finding the length so length cannot be negative so we are rejecting minus 14 so the value of x we will take 10 so x means a break of rectangle so therefore we write breadth is equal to 10 centimeter so therefore length is equal to so length you have taken as x plus 4 so x plus 4 means 10 plus 4 so 10 plus 4 means 14 centimeter so therefore finally perimeter is equal to 2 into length plus breadth so 2 into 10 plus 14 So 2 into 10 plus 14 will become 24 and 2 into 24 becomes 48 centimeter. So this is the final answer for this question. So guys thanks for watching this video and please subscribe my channel for more solution like this.